How well do you know your own body? You'd know if you were sick, right? But how long would it take for you to recognize the symptoms? By monitoring your vitals closely using sensors, it's possible to detect when you're sick sooner. This could help you prevent the spread of a contagious illness you might be carrying and allow you to seek treatment much sooner. Some studies have shown promise detecting illness using commercially available consumer wearable devices. However, these commercial devices tend to use hard-to-replace proprietary chargers and even have privacy concerns around them due to their proprietary nature. They also lack some sensors we thought were fun and possibly useful. For these reasons, we decided to create our own health monitoring wearable device. This is what we created, the BioSense wearable. Our device's design and software is open source, although it does use some proprietary firmware. It also uses a standard USB-C connector for charging. The device is capable of measuring skin temperature, ambient temperature, heart rate, motion, and UV light. We could also add an air quality sensor if the part ever came back in stock. The top of the case is open so that we can marvel at our design, and certainly not because we didn't want to remove the connectors on top that are useful for debugging. We have a companion app that can extract sensor data from the SD card or connect to the device over USB or Bluetooth. It produces CSVs ready for further processing and can graph data for demonstration. Note that analyzing the data is outside the scope of our project. One of our design goals was to produce something as small as possible. To our credit, the device fits comfortably on a wrist. Another design goal was to keep the wearable cheap and accessible. Each unit we assembled cost roughly 100 Canadian dollars. This project was quite ambitious. It was done by four engineering students who were already engaged in full-time academic studies over the course of two semesters. As such, we weren't quite able to complete everything we would have wanted. The heart rate sensor drivers are unfinished, the air quality sensor drivers were never started, and we never did obtain a UV light sensor. Jason Nintop did the electrical design work. Samuel Dewan did the hardware assembly and much of the software. Morgan Smith did a little software and fabricated the enclosure. And Teague McDonald Jensen did the companion software. Open source wearables will likely grow in popularity moving forward due to concerns with how large corporations deal with user privacy, among other concerns. The Pine Time is an open source wearable that is currently picking up steam, and more open source wearables are likely on the way. We're happy to put our design out publicly for others to use, and we hope some good comes of it.